Hey there fellow exercisers, I'm Megan and let's uh, get ready to rumble here. But first I would like to dedicate this workout to a very dear friend of mine who passed away recently. This one's for you, Johnny. Okay, so let's get warmed up. Let's uh, just do some jumping jacks here. Keep your stomach really, really tight as always. Stay nice and light on your toes. And this first exercise, I just thought of this morning. Ooh, it's such a good one. Okay, so what you're gonna do, let's start on our right leg. We're gonna do four of them. You're gonna squat, just like um, the squat push-up jumpers, but on one leg. So squat, push-up position, stomach in, head straight. You're gonna hold that left leg up. Don't let it drop. Push up with the body straight, stomach in, stand up. And you're gonna jump, lifting the arms up as you jump. So let's do four on the right foot and four on the left foot. And here we go. Squat, leg up, push up and jump, arms up, that's one. You can go on your knee if you have to for your push up, that's fine. Going for three, good job, good job. Ooh, oh, that's good. And now quick on the left leg. So squat. Now right leg's gonna stay up, stomach in, arms up, that's one. Breathe, that's two, you got it. That's three, you got it. Hold that back leg up. Four, awesome job. And we're gonna go right into squat jump, half turns. So you're gonna stick the butt out, arms in front. We're gonna do six to the right and six to the left. So as you jump, your arms are gonna lift up, then you're gonna land back in the squat, then you're gonna jump back to the left. So you're gonna go right, left, right, left. Six of those, and then six starting on the left. Okay, here we go. And one, to the right, to the left, two, higher, three, stick it out, four, up, five, and six. Okay, and starting with the left now. And stick it out. And a one. Two. You got it. Three. Four. Five. Six. Excellent. Okay, now let's do my favorite stretch. Uh, you're going to put your left foot forward and your right foot pointing to the right. Grab your right hand to your right ankle and look up at your left hand. Roll that wrist. Ah, feels great. Which oh, stretches right here. Excellent, now let's do the other side. So your right foot's gonna face forward, left foot to the left. Grab the left ankle with the left hand, look up at your right hand, roll that wrist. Ah, oh, that is wonderful. And now put your hands in the middle. Um, just try your best if you need to open your legs wider. That's cool. Um, just uh, do what you can. And we're gonna go up like this, you're gonna to touch your fingertips. It's a really good shoulder um, stretch. I really like this one. Keep it going. And now we're gonna go right into four walks to the back in a straddle. So you're gonna first push your shoulders, ribs in, look at your fingers, lean forward, don't jump. And you're gonna reach the feet back, slide the hands forward, that's one. And two, you got it. Don't bend the arms, three, Get those hips up, four, and now we're gonna go to the front. Lean forward, ribs in, one, hands first, then feet. And lift, two, remember not to jump. And three, you should feel your stomach working if you're doing it correctly. <sighs> Excellent, okay, now we're gonna go over to the couch or a table. So let's go on over. Okay, so our first exercise, um, I've done this one before. It's my super favorite crunch ever. So you're going to stick your left foot under the couch or table or something with a space under there. And your right leg's gonna be up. Scoot your butt out a little and you're gonna use this thigh um, to help you in your crunch. Keep your chin up, hands behind your head, lift. And let's do 20 like that, keep your stomach in. And one, and two, three. This one works the best out of any crunch 
I think I've ever tried. Six, seven, eight. Keep the chest open. 11, 12, chin up, 13, you got it, 14, 15, 16, 17, think of how good you'll look after, 20, and get your arms up, reach straight up to the ceiling, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, and switch, usually I do 30 of the first kind and 20 of the second kind, so if you want to do those numbers, go for it. Okay, here we go. One, two, left legs up. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You got it. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Chin up. Sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. And twelve of these kinds straight to the ceiling. Chin up. One, two, three, four. Pull the stomach in. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, oh my goodness, you can totally feel it. You can feel it in my legs too. Now you're gonna turn around, grab under the couch, and put your legs in a 90 degree angle. Let's just do 10 hips up, and then back down to here. Uh, so one, and two, really pull that stomach in. Three, this is good for the lower stomach. Four, five. You got it. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now you're gonna go hips all the way up. Squeeze your butt like you can't squeeze it anymore. You're gonna keep the stomach in. Keep the hips in one line as long as you can. And then you're gonna lower to here without letting the back arch. And that's one. Let's go for two, slow. And three, hollow. Get, squeeze the butt, get the hips up as quickly as you can on the way up. Oh, my voice did something funny there. That's two, and that's three. Squeeze it. Oh, this is hard. That's four, and one more. We used to do a lot of these in gymnastics. Excellent. I think that's five. Okay, so now we're gonna just do diagonal, um, just 10 times. You can keep the hips down for this one. Just hold on to whatever you're holding on to. And that's one, get the sides of us a little. Two, three, four, five, excellent. Six, seven, burn those love handles. Eight, nine, 10, awesome job. Okay, now let's get the back side of us real quick. Go ahead and lay on your stomach. Stick those feet onto there. Hands behind your head. Remember to pull your shoulders down and shoulder blades together so you can get that upper back. And up. Let's do 10 of these. Two, three. Great for the back side of us. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And now we're going to twist. Pull those shoulder blades together. Twist it. Excellent job. Higher. Woo. Keep it going. Woo. Nice. Okay, now let's quickly go to our side. So let's go on our right side. Forearm down. Make sure the left side of your body is totally straight up. We're just going to do 10 pulses. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Hold it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Pull that left hand in, arm in. You're gonna go to the left side immediately. One, two, three, four, five, six. Doing great, everyone. Seven, eight. Whoa, this pigtail's out of control. Nine, ten. Hold it for five. One, two, three, four, five. And now reverse hollow body hold, and then we're done. And walk those hands out as far as you can, keeping the stomach in. Very important. Don't arch or don't even do it. One, two, three. Four, five, look at the fingers. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, if you feel yourself shaking, that is good. Excellent job, everyone. Okay, back to the floor now. Um, let's do just a little quick mini ab uh, series here. So you're just gonna reach from heel to heel, side to side. We're gonna do 10 
just regular, and then 10, lifting your whole chest off the ground. If it gets to be too hard, then just stick to uh, the regular way without lifting your chest all the way up. Okay, here we go. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, keep it up, eight, nine, 10, and lift it. One, two, three, you got it. Four, pull your stomach in, five, six, seven, excellent, eight, nine, and 10, and reach it. One, two, three, four, doing great. Five, six, seven, pull the stomach, eight, nine, 10, and let's do the lifters. One, two, excellent, three, four, I can start to feel it now. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and now right into 10 V-ups really quick. If the V-ups are too hard for you, you can just lay here like this and lift the feet up and down like that with the stomach pulled in like so much. Here we go, one, two, three, you got it, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Excellent, now we're gonna do 10 straight leg sit-ups. I actually kinda took a week and a half break off from exercising like so much because I was going nuts with my gymnastics training for the TV show. Up, reach for the feet, up and down. But the show ended, so I kinda give my, gave myself a little break. Let these muscles, you know, get relaxed. It's always good to, you know, if you're going nuts, you know, with your body, give it a little break sometimes. Nothing wrong with that. And now I can definitely notice that um, I'm getting back into the shape. But let's do it together. Excellent. And reach. So again, of course, these are the ones that always pull my pants off. Oh my goodness. Nice. Let's do one more. Up and reach. And for our last exercise, this one I just thought of this morning also. Um, it's a hard one. You're going to lift your butt up we, and uh, right leg up. You're going to do your tricep dip, which we've done. And then you're going to hop. And we're going to attempt eight on each leg. If that's too hard for you, you can just sit here like this and do dips down and up. Okay, let's go for it. Try and pull that butt up each time so you work your hamstring and your butt also. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh wow, that's hard. And yeah, I can feel it in my calf muscle too. That's crazy. Okay, pull it up. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Awesome job, everyone. Okay, press handstand time. Hope I can still do it. Oh boy, give me the strength. Here we go. Oh, thank goodness. All out of spin, why not? Ugh. Okay, everyone. Thanks so much for tuning in. And here's to being strong and have a wonderful day. I'll see you soon. Bye.